Hi and welcome back to Toulon Naval Base. Today we are on board Horizon Type Air Defense Destroyer Forbin to discuss Veille Cooperative Naval, which is said to become the own French Navy version of CEC, the Cooperative Engagement Capability. I am here with the commanding officer of the Forbin, Commander Grau, to learn more about this uh, upcoming capability for the French Navy. Commander, good morning. Good morning. Can you first please tell us uh, about the test that took place earlier this year? Yeah, so in uh, September, last September, uh, we carried out a missile firing exercise uh, off the coast of Toulon, uh, near Levant Island, where our DGA uh, center for uh, missile trials is set. And so first, uh, I'd like to say that those missile firings are very important steps in our combat training. This was emphasized in um, the Navy's strategic plan uh, issued last year, it's called Plan Mercator. And we uh, seized the opportunity of every uh, of those firings to test new tactics, to uh, try to push the limits of the domain of employment of those weapons. So what was specific about uh, last firing in September is that it was the first uh, missile firing for the French Navy that took place with the shooter in total radar, radar silence. Uh, so that means that actually it was a dual ship uh, firing. So Forbin was the uh, firing unit, but it was accompanied by a uh, French destroyer Languedoc, which is one of our uh, latest uh, destroyers, uh, multi-mission uh, destroyer. And so Languedoc was actually reporting via uh, tactical data link uh, the target at all time and we were totally silent so we fired on the target that was reported solely by uh, by uh, long dog so to to give a, a comparison it's a bit like as if you were a sharpshooter trying to uh, shoot at balloon for instance but with a blindfold and so it's only uh, your spotter that gives you the information to uh, to shoot on balloon uh, now you, uh, you make the balloon a fast target, the bullet a very fast uh, missile, and you multiply the distance by a few dozens, and that gives you a rough idea of what happened uh, in September. Why is this a uh, game changer in terms of naval warfare? It is not a game changer per se, because um, as you know, naval units act as a network at sea, and so they share the tactical situation at all times via tactical data link, and that is exploited by the combat management system. But um, it demonstrates the fact that those uh, tactical data links and those CMS are very efficient, and that they can um, build a very robust defense uh, against aircraft and missiles at sea. Which type of uh, missile did you use and which type of uh, data link uh, do you use for this? Okay, so we used the uh, Link 16 data link, which is the fastest uh, data link uh, up to date, and uh, which is quite dedicated to uh, anti-air warfare. And uh, we fired an Aster 30 uh, missile at the target and it was successful. Very few navies in the world uh, have that kind of uh, capability. Uh, speaking about uh, CEC, I can only think about uh, the US Navy, of course, mm -hmm. because it's an American system. Mm -hmm. But uh, I think the Japanese Navy uh, will be getting it as well as uh, the Royal Australian Navy. Mm -hmm. The Marine National doesn't have it yet, but mm -hmm. uh, will have that capability uh, down the road. Can you confirm that uh, it will be a first in Europe? Yes, absolutely. So you're referring to uh, what we call naval civilian, uh, cooperative civilians. Uh, so that's an experiment right now, uh, but it's uh, coming in in the next few years and it will enhance uh, again this uh, cooperation and collaboration uh, capability. To go again with my comparison with the, uh, the sharpshooter, so um, in our case we were relying on uh, the indications of the spotter uh, with the uh, naval uh, cooperative civilians, it will be a bit as if the shooter uh, could see through the eyes of the spotter. So that's like connecting the brains in a way. Last but not least, uh, what's next for the French Navy? Is uh, this uh, system and technology set to be deployed across all surface combatants or all major surface combatants of the French Navy? Uh, yes, well again, it's an experiment right now, but the aim uh, will be to deploy it on all the major combatants, of course. Thank you very much. You're very welcome. Detection ship dans le 63. Twenty-two. 